excited and we're here at Goodwill on 7th Avenue in Indian School and you're gonna join me as I look for my outfit of the week. Let's go! So today I'm looking for a fall inspired outfit so I'm gonna layer since it's getting a little chilly here in Arizona. I'm looking for scarves, jackets, um, things that I can take off once it starts heating up again by noon. So I'm gonna start in the coat section since that is kind of the key piece and usually what gets the most attention. So I'll go there and then I'll layer from once I have to. So I range from a size small to medium and I would say don't be too judgmental with sizes. There's times that I've worn extra large dresses just because I like the fit of it. So don't be closed minded about it. Very versatile. Never say no to brand name items. This is a J. Crew blazer. And Express. So today I'm gonna go for a casual chic office um, style outfit, fit for fall. Um, like I said, a lot of these pieces are convertible, so I'll be able to take them off as it heats up um, and then hopefully transition them into summer as well when it heats up next year. So one of my tips um, when shopping at Goodwill, because I find such inexpensive items, is I want to wear the piece at least three different ways. So if that means pairing it with jeans, pairing it with a dress, or even in the summer pairing it with shorts and make it a more casual look, that's my rule. I have to wear it at least three different ways before I commit to purchasing it. And that goes for $15 items or dollar days. Um, I want to make sure that I get the most use out of them. Now that I have some jackets pulled, um, I'm going to go to the pants, so check out some bottoms. Um, I'm going to try to go for a more um, simple look today. Like I said, I want to be able to wear these outfits more than once, so maybe some black pants. Let's see what we find. So the good thing about Goodwill is that there is an abundance of stuff. It could also be more overwhelming. So just make sure to look through every single hanger. Um, you never know what you're going to find. You never know what designer you'll miss if you just kind of go through. So let's um, slide hanger by hanger and see um, what cool finds we see. So like I mentioned, I was going for black caps just because they're very versatile and I can pair them with really anything. So I found some Calvin Klein jeans. Um, my idea for these is to rip the knees and actually make them look a lot more stylish than this. Um, and then I found some Express um, pants as well. I love these because they're great for an office look. Um, I can pair them with a tank top and make it a little bit more casual. So let's see if either one of these fits. So for tops, what I like to do is avoid the patterns. I've noticed that I wear my plain tops a lot more often than the ones with designs just because people can't really notice when I repeat, just like this Banana Republic top that I'm wearing right now. I paired it with a um, patterned um, skirt, uh, but I could wear it again next week with jeans. So like I mentioned, um, plain colors always do the best in your closet because you could repurpose it with different types of outfits. So I got a knitted sweater. These go great under blazers. Sometimes it gets a bit too hot um, in the summer, but they're great layered in the fall because you can take off the jacket midday. Um, I love, love, love how thin this um, shirt is because layered with the scarf and layered with a blazer or jacket, it's perfect and doesn't get too hot. I also got a tan Banana Republic shirt. Actually, my whole outfit today is Banana Republic that I also got um, here at Goodwill, so it's one of my favorite brands. 
And then I got a Target branded um, sweater, which can also be repurposed as a dress depending on your height. So I'm gonna try this on um, and see if it works for me. So now that we have a cart full of clothes, we're gonna head over to the shoes and see what we can pair up um, with these outfits. to keep my options open um, there's nothing wrong with putting things in your cart and then putting them back so if there's ever anything you're debating it might not be in the rack when you come back to it so just put it in your cart save it aside you can always try it on and put it back when you're done with it so don't feel bad about just stacking up your cart so like I mentioned keeping your options open is a huge part of thrifting so I got some pants but just in case I decided to go the dress route um, I came to the dress section and I found a ju Juicy Couture um, fit and flare dress as well as a J. Crew cute little blush dress. Now, like I mentioned, these would look great under blazers even for the fall um, with a scarf paired with a pair of boots. Uh, so yeah, we're going to try those on as well. So let's try some of these things on. I love, love, love this one. So again, it's a juicy dress. It's a little black dress, which I think is a staple for any closet. So if you don't already have one, make sure. Um, this one's a little bit more fun, which I love. There's nothing simple about it. And the coat looks great quality. Um, it looks great with any outfit. I can easily remove it. Um, I can easily remove it if it gets a little too hot in the afternoon, but um, paired it as well with some Alto flats. Um, super comfortable, super professional. I can also wear the flats with jeans, like I mentioned. We try to wear each item at least three different ways to get the most use out of them. So, what do you guys think? We have outfit number two. I paired the Target sweater with the Express blazer, Calvin Klein pants, and some cheetah print sneakers. Just to add a little pop of print and fun. This is great because you can wear it to the office, you can wear it to dinner, depending on the accessories. It looks very casual, chic, yet professional. Um, so, how do you guys feel about this one? So after trying on the red sweater, I decided that a skirt would actually look pull the whole look together so we're gonna go see if we can find maybe a black cinched uh, waisted skirt um, let's go check This is the perfect, perfect fall inspired outfit. 
I paired this maroon sweater from Target with this express blazer. Last minute, I found this suede vintage skirt that has pockets in it. Um, and of course, the very playful cheetah um, sneakers, which just give the look a little bit of more fun um, and friendly feel. You can wear this to the office, you can wear this on a date. I'll wear it to brunch on Sunday with my girlfriends as well. <laughs> So I think we got it guys. The outfit of the week was picked out here at the Goodwill on 7th Avenue in Indian School. I paired this express blazer with a sweater from Target, a vintage suede skirt with fun pockets on it, and some very fun cheetah print sneakers ready for fall um, and all on a budget. I can't wait to share the full look with you guys on Goodwill's Instagram. Stay tuned for the full outfit. So we couldn't say no to this Juicy Couture dress, so it's outfit of the week number two. There's two outfits this week. There's too many good things to pass up. Um, hope you like them. So guys, that was it. We have our two, not one, but two outfits of the week in these goodie bags. Uh, remember to follow Goodwill AZ on Instagram and Facebook to make sure you see the full outfits and details there.